hey guys like hey guys like I totally made it to September on my low buy no buy but now those sleigh bells are ringing in the Christmas arrival in the beauty community beauty world Sephora Ulta Macy's you name it has been knocking on the door so that being said since all the beauty items have started to surface and you know in the beauty community fall winter and holiday mesh together and all this new stuff is like coming out taking place flashing us in our face I decided I wanted to make a wish list so I'm going to be letting you guys know the things that I am choosing to gun hold by think about and probably will pass um, I don't have any fancy you know graphics or computer ish stuff or camera stuff so there ain't no popping up nowhere I may throw in a picture <laughs> and then come back whatever you'll see or I may put it at the end I don't know however I choose to um, edit this video but anyways I'm gonna give you the top six things that I am gun ho pretty much gonna buy and I'm just gonna jump into it Tarte Tarte is a brand that I talk about pretty often on this channel for some reason I'm fascinated with Tarte so I'm not getting everything that Tarte has because I'm just not but the things that I want to get are the brush sets originally they had one out now there are two so I don't know if one's gonna be with Sephora and the other one with Ulta I don't really care I want both of them um, they're really really pretty they're different from each other but they may have like one or two brushes that are similar so those two brush sets I want so that's one and two my third thing that I want to get is um, Too Faced's uh, Boss Lady Planner Palette it's really really pretty the palette is sleek and thin so it's not bulky <coughs> you don't have to find a place to put it so that is one of the things that I am interested and in, probably gonna get even though like normal there are some repeat colors but I can look past the three to four <laughs> the five repeat colors I just saw that they have one similar at Ulta but it's a little smaller and it's mint green cute too I'm gotta weigh my options between the two so that is three items that I'm getting the fourth item that I want to get is um, Too Faces gingerbread liquid lipstick I got the liquid lipstick last year love it the gingerbread color is really pretty drawing me in it's got me I know it's got a flavor to it so that is one of the things that I want to get um fourth thing I want to get oh back to Tarte I want to get their blush palette the one that's the circular disc that's going to be exclusively a Sephora I told myself I wasn't going to get it and I told myself I wasn't going to get no tart blush this year because their holiday blushes are a little bit different in formula than your the regular line the regular line I really really like it's a you know kind of a harder pan but I just like the formula better but I'm enticed it's drawn me in I'm probably gonna get it um the one from Ulta I'm gonna pass on unless I swatch it and I'm drawn in but it's not one that I'm going to jump out and get so that's four things in the fifth no I don't know I think that's four one two three four five all right I think that was I think that was five but my sixth item that I want to get is the smash fox palette that comes with the two palettes and the highlight palette that's a really good deal so hopefully by the time I get it it's still in stock 
So those are the things, six things that I absolutely want to get and I'm good, I'm golden. Um, I don't want to go crazy at all because I'm still in the mindset of panning and decluttering and making things using things up and figuring out my collection. So I don't want to go crazy or overboard. So my maybes, um, and my maybes are the Hourglass palette. It's crazy expensive. That's why it's a maybe. It's small and I don't know how the colors are going to work for me. So I really would like to swatch it just to figure it out. I wish Hourglass would make it like 20 to 25 dollars cheaper than what it really is like I don't understand why I make a palette that I just don't understand it but anyway so it's a maybe the Laura Mercier um, highlight palette is my second maybe um, the Bobbi Brown highlight palette which I think I think I saw pictures of a highlight palette coming out but that's my third maybe um, the Tarte Lip Lingerie Palette 5 Lip Lingeries, that is my fourth maybe. Um, and I say that because I really am not wanting to get any lip products. I'm just, I, I just ain't. So those are all my maybes. I think that is it. Maybe the Tarte um, Eyeshadow Palette at Sephora because I've been seeing swatches. And they've been looking kind of good because I've been a little iffy and a little leery about their holiday palettes. And I've stayed away from them for the past two years. I've stayed away from Too Faced for the past two years. So, we'll see. And my kind of pretty much nose are, I'm not really getting no lipsticks. I have enough. I'm going through my lipsticks and I'm trying to pan and use up what I have and, and this stuff is not moving fast enough so yeah and I hate to waste money I hate to buy something and it get, just sits there so no lipsticks no skincare this is the best time to buy skincare sales deals coupons the best time but I'm a Mary Kay consultant and I sell skincare and um what else am I not going to get? I think that might be it. I know for sure I'm not going to get the Too Faced Mint Chocolate Palette. Because the colors just don't seem like they would be fitting of me or my skin tone. But I am enticed in that Clover Palette that I don't know when it's coming out. Probably in the spring. They just, the sneak peek was like heck of a lot early probably after Christmas it'll come out but um I just feel like we complained about the bring-ins just being average with their colors or reaping colors and Too Faced looked like they were trying to do something different and put a different color scheme palette together and I, that's one of the reasons why I'm going to get the Clover palette um I probably won't get the Lorette Pro 4 palette because the colors, I don't know. I'm just not drawn to it. I was drawn to the one last year even though I didn't get it and I was drawn to the first one even though I didn't get it. Um, I'm trying to think what other stuff is going to be out. I haven't really seen anything from Urban Decay. So, I don't know. Maybe their stuff will pop out in October. Some of the brands will wait until like the end of October or middle of October to bring out their stuff. Unlike like Tarte and Too Faced who jump on it hell of early and their stuff be sold out hell of early and it, it be sold out before Thanksgiving but anyways I think that is it thank you for joining me in my wish list for the beauty items that I am wanting or not wanting or thinking about and if you have anything on your list drop it down in the comments below let's have a good dialogue and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.